What is up? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about the highly anticipated one and only brand spanking new Ozone Collection from Alpha Leaf. That is right, this is a brand new seamless collection never before seen that will be launching in their summer launch. Their summer launch will be dropping Saturday, July 9th at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. The Ozone along with their revamped performance line. But for today's video, we are solely focusing on the Ozone collection. If you're a huge fan of Seamless, raise your hand. There's no doubt about it. If you are familiar with my channel, you know I always favor the Seamless, especially when it comes to the gym. That's pretty much all I wear. Alpha Elite has done yet another Seamless range, so we're about to see what's it about. Does it compare to the Amplify? We'll do a little comparison of that. Before we hop into the fine details, I wanna give you guys a nice little background of what makes this collection stand on its own. So the Ozone Collection took Alpha Elite about 16 months to make. These pieces are crafted with a tri-blend of nylon and spandex. These pieces were made with a special recycling process that saves up to 58% in water consumption, 80% in energy expenditures, and saves about 76% in carbon dioxide emissions. Alphaly actually said, quote unquote, that the ozone is the softest and the most shape retaining seamless that they offer. Now that's a pretty bold statement, especially because we all know what Alpha Lead's capable of, AKA, hence the Amplify. I mean, right off the bat, I'm seeing some similarities to the Amplify, such as the three tier waistband, the same embroidered logo on the back of the band, but we will get into that in just a second. Before we move on, do not forget to subscribe to this channel. We have new Alpha Lee unreleased videos every single month. So if you're a huge fan of Alpha Lee, you might wanna consider subscribing and hitting that bell so you do not miss a thing. Especially because we're gonna have a giveaway, a few giveaways in this video. So you're gonna to need to be subscribed for that. So you might as well do it now. And in case you missed it in my last Alpha Lee video, we did announce that our codes now give you 10% off. So do us both a favor, use code GATA at checkout. This helps you save 10% and it also helps to support this channel to keep these reviews coming your way. So the Ozone Collection is going to be releasing five unique pieces. It's time to break out my handy dandy notebook, AKA my back book. So the first piece we have is the Ozone Crop Bra, I'm wearing it right now. This will be coming in the colors mauve, grape, Lavender, Gingerbread, Daffodil, Pistachio, Atlantic Blue, Carbon, and Black. Obviously, you can see right out the gate that there's a ton of colors to choose from, everything from lights to darks. Okay, let's start with the sports bra. I'm wearing a size medium in the sports bra. I have a small in the blue, which I will insert a clip of me wearing it, but I wanted to up the size a little bit just to show some comparison. And as you can see, the medium is okay, but you can see a lot of extra baggage right around here. Totally should have stuck to the true size small, so keep that in mind, very true to size up top. I am a 34B. For reference, all my measurements will be down below for you. So I really do like the high neck on this sports bra. I would give it a moderate support though. I still don't feel like there's a ton of support going on right here. I don't know if you guys could notice. Well, first of all, there's a little stain going on here. I just dripped coffee all over myself before. <laughs> Can you guys see the bra pads? Because when I put it on in certain lighting, it was so obvious in this color that I was like, holy shit. <laughs> in certain lighting, I don't see it. Like right now, it's not too bad, but dude, be mindful of that. All over comfort though, I will give it that. There's no dig, there's nothing in the way. It's a very, very comfortable fit right around the armpit area. But keep in mind, this is a medium, so it's a little bit big on me. So we can only do right by comparing it to a small. So let's go ahead and do that. Ah, okay, small fits so much better. Yeah, all right, yeah. It's feeling a little snug where it needs to be. Ooh, a little bit better support, okay. What's really nice is the darker colors, you do not see any sheerness right around here. So you don't see the bra pads. So even in the small, there's no digging, no restriction whatsoever. This material is really nice. The stretches, look at that, pretty decent here. I would still stick to your true size. Whatever that may be, stick to it. Even if my boobs were a little bit bigger, I still feel like I would get away with this size small. There's no moving up either, which I really like. So if I was really swinging around my arms, yeah, this isn't, this isn't moving around. It's staying in place pretty nicely. Keep in mind, this is not a high impact sports bra, even though you might think it is because of the high neck, really nice coverage, but again, moderate support. 
In terms of design, if you look closely, you could see a lot of rib paneling going on, tons of curved accents. And I was sitting here saying to myself, Ash, why does this look so familiar? This is reminding me of something. So picture the halo legging and the alpha elite long sleeve rib design kind of meshed and had a little baby of its own. That is how I'm feeling with this set. We got some rib paneling going on on the halo and especially on this long sleeve amplify. You basically have the same types of movements going on. Super similar in terms of design, very subtle contouring, but yet it's there. They're also launching one type of fitted short. It's a five and a half inch inseam. I know I'm gonna get questions. The shorts will be coming in the colors mauve, grape, lavender, gingerbread, daffodil, pistachio, Atlantic blue, carbon, and black. So pretty much the same as the sports bras. You can get yourself a matching set. Speaking of bottoms, let's talk about these shorts for a sec. I am so, so glad that Alpha Elite kept their three tier tapered waistband. I wasn't really vibing with the halo. That waistband was kind of meh. I feel like the halo band had a little too much let up, not enough compression where I needed it. So it felt like it would slide down over time. Whereas this feels like the Amplify waistband, which it technically is the Amplify waistband. Same exact waistband, even the size is the same. Without a doubt though, this daffodil, as beautiful as it is, it's just a no-go when it comes to sheerness. This is, this is crazy going on. Standing up, you can see, you can see, <laughs> you can see what I'm talking about. I'm wearing a size medium short. This is my go-to nowadays when it comes to tight fitted shorts. I feel most comfortable with sizing up. I typically go with a small, like in leggings and things, but this medium is just working for me. This is my problem area, which is why I size up in tight fit shorts. If it's not of concern to you, I think you can stick with your true size. If it wasn't for this, I would stick to my true size small because you got a little bit of extra wrinkling around here. And I have to say, I've tried on recycled materials before and they're typically very wrinkly, kind of stiff in a way. This is not too bad. This has a nice decent stretch to it. Definitely not as stretchy as the Amplify, so do not get it twisted. Don't think, don't think for a second that you're gonna be getting the Amplify kind of vibes here, cause you're not. Speaking of Amplify, let's check out the glue area. What are we looking at? Now, this is not a scrunch bump. You got a breakup seam going right down your ass cheeks. I'm gonna see if I can make it look like I'm wearing a scrunch though. Whoa. Uh, uh, uh. See, now it looks really bad. <laughs> when you try to ride it up, now you can see the wrinkles tenfold. Literally, fold. I would say the shorts are very true to size. Stick with your natural size. If this area is just a big deal to you, you could get away with sizing up, but this will happen. You will be experiencing some wrinkles. So with that being said, let me try on a size small. This is the grape color. Let's check out if I get any weird camel toe or anything, because right now this is smooth as butter down here. Ooh, size small. Yeah, this is definitely not as stretchy as Amplify. In fact, even in the small, I'm feeling a little, yeah, it's a little, a little toughy, a little toughy. Definitely digging into the thighs a bit more, so not horribly, but yeah, it's there. Sizing down to my true size small, you can really feel the difference in the waistband. There's so much more compression going on, not only in the band, but definitely around the thighs as well. Even though it's tighter, there's still no dreaded CT. It feels great. And I'm definitely seeing a lot less wrinkling going on right around here. If I tug it up to kind of get it up the glutes, let's see. Not as bad as sizing up, okay. You wanna avoid wrinkles, stick to your true size. Oh, thank God, that's better. Okay, sorry, I had to change the sports bra color because that blue with the grape just... <laughs> First thing I notice when squatting in these size smalls is the wow, that roll up instantaneously. Let's take it from the top, I'm gonna smooth it out, I'm gonna do about 10 squats, and let's see how bad the roll up gets. Yeah, it's there. <laughs> Luckily it doesn't like snatch its way all the way up, but nevertheless, there's a little bit of a roll. This is what it looks like if you're really hiking it up. Cause I know a lot of people really love that short, short look and it is cute. There's only to twist it. I think it's really cute. But for me, I just, <laughs> I never feel like I can really pull that look off. But uh, this is what it would look like if you're really trying to hike it up and give yourself some booty shorts to work out in. 
Definitely grab the grape or any of the darker colors if you're looking for squat proof and I would avoid that daffodil color. I'm not a huge fan of the material in terms of this lack of stretch. That kind of bothers me. Like when I lift my legs up, you can feel a little bit of that restriction. I think it's really good if you're, if you're really training hardcore at the gym because you got a nice decent amount of support because of that. But for me, I just, I'm more of like an amplify girl where I like more stretch, the better. I'm mostly feeling it right around this area, not even the band. The band is still has that, that stretch to it. Do you see that? It's a very comfortable fit for being moderately compressive in the band area. It's just right here where it's feeling not so stretchy. This is as far as I could stretch the band out. Big difference. Throwing back on the yellow real quick to do a squat test. Wow, after comparing to the small grape and the medium daffodil, these are so much more comfortable. Oh, there's no restriction compared to the small. Not as bad. No roll at all. Okay. The pros of sizing up. No roll up when squatting. A lot more comfortable, in my opinion. <laughs> Feels stretchier. And no sausaging around my thighs. I would say the one con of sizing up would be a little bit of extra wrinkling going on. That's really it. We got the ozone legging, 25 inch inseam. Look at this gingerbread. I'm already loving the gingerbread and daffodil together. How about you? These leggings will be coming in the colors mauve, grape, lavender, gingerbread, daffodil, pistachio, Atlantic blue, carbon, and black. The leggings are very, very stretchy this way, but not so much this way. In other words, it was super easy to put on and pull up the leg but it's still just like the shorts, not a whole lot of stretch going on right here. Another thing that kind of irks me about these leggings is the fact that the seam comes up so far. If you look closely, I'll insert a clip. The stitched seam actually goes up above the band. It intrudes into the three tier tapered waistband. I mean, it's not a huge deal, but it's one of those things where I'm like, why? And I'm a little bit insulted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not insulted, but why? The green is not fully squat proof, but it's more squat proof than the daffodil. <laughs> I'm also feeling compared to the Amplify, this is the, the deciding factor right here after putting the leggings on, that this is a lot less compressive in the waistband and it could be because it's a lighter color. So I'm gonna try on the gingerbread and see if the darker color has more of a compressive waistband. Because as we know, the darker the dye, the tighter the fit could be. Here's to the gingerbread. Okay, so after trying the gingerbread color on, I'm feeling the same amount of compression as I did in the green. So I guess it was just that grape color that just felt like it was just snatching up the waist. So for me, the most compressive waistband was in the color grape. Overall, I would explain this material is soft. It's relatively breathable and you can feel the wicking properties, but it's definitely not as breathable as the Amplify. So in direct comparison, you're looking at the Amplify, which is like wearing stockings. <laughs> that is how breathable and lightweight they are. Whereas this new Ozone has a little more thickness to it, a lot more compression, not as breathable and a little more dense, not as lightweight. I do think that if you're in between, in between sizes, you could get away with sizing down. I'm actually favoring the darker colors in this range, believe it or not, not only for squat proof sake, but I actually think it just looks more flattering. I feel like you don't see that crazy seam as much. It's a little more subtle on the behind. So I think if I'm gonna grab some colors, it's gonna be darker colors. Stop right there. Hold up, we have an Alpha League giveaway. As a huge thank you to you for getting us to 50K. I still can't get over that. Alphalete and I have teamed up to give you guys three chances to win an Alphalete gift card. We are giving away two $100 Alphalete gift cards and one $250 Alphalete gift card. So there will be three winners in total, two winning the $100 gift card and the one grand prize winner winning the $250 gift card. All you have to do to enter is be subscribed to this channel, subscribe to Alpha Elite's YouTube channel as well, give this video a like, and comment down below your favorite color from the Ozone Collection. This giveaway will be closing Thursday, July 7th at 11 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time. This gives us all day Thursday and all day Friday to get the giveaway winners their gift cards so that they can use it on Saturday for the launch. 
I will be directly replying to the winner's comments. This way I can grab your contact info and get the gift card sent over to you. Two things to keep in mind. Number one, get those post notifications turned on. There's no way to let you know that I responded if you ain't got the post notifications on. Turn those post notifications on because you have 24 hours to respond or else I have no choice but to redraw. This has happened before where I'll be waiting a week or two for the winner's response and that's not fair to others. So you do have the full 24 hours to reply. If not, I'm gonna have to delete that comment, act like it never existed and then redraw. Lastly, and this is a big one, if anybody replies to your comment acting like they're me, <laughs> saying you won the giveaway and getting you all excited for nothing, you must ignore them, block them, do whatever you have to do. I will only be replying to the giveaway winners under this YouTube username, Ashley Gata. Some assholes out there, they might be using my name, but like tweaking it a little bit. And then if you read it real quick, you think it's me responding. I don't want people to get their hopes up. This happened to many, many people in the last giveaway and it's pretty messed up. I have since then really tried to hone down on cracking down. Since then, I've blocked a whole bunch of trigger words. So bottom line, the only person who's gonna be responding to your comment letting you know you won is moi. Best of luck and thank you to Alphalete. Now let's get back to it. They're also releasing a long sleeve fitted crop top that is high neck. These will be coming in the colors mauve, pistachio, lavender, gingerbread, Atlantic blue, carbon, and black. So as you can see, these are not coming in as many colors as the sports bra you just saw. So keep that in mind when you're making your list of what you wanna get. I think the high neck is really a nice touch. This is the first piece where I actually feel like there's a full... <laughs> this fucking stupid plant. Get out of here, nobody cares about you. This is the first piece where I feel like I can really move around in it and it's a full spectrum of stretch. Whereas, you know what I said, like the leg, and there's a certain point where it just stops. Here, I don't feel that one bit. Thank goodness, because then how on earth would I wear this long sleeve? What's the point? <laughs> Let's see if it's like the other long sleeves that they have like the amplifier where it just rides right up. <laughs> Not as bad. What I notice is this actually has a little more length to it than the amplify long sleeves, which are a bit more cropped. So that's good. Okay, good. Right off the bat, I definitely prefer this ozone long sleeve over the amplify long sleeve. I actually really love that it comes lower in the back too. You remember the amplifier where it just like kept riding up back here and you see the, the sports bra underneath? This isn't doing that, thank goodness. When I first saw this piece, I thought for sure that the neck area would be very wrinkly, but to my surprise, it's actually laying nice and flat. Keep in mind though, this is just a long sleeve. There's no built-in bra underneath, no padding, nothing like that. It's just a long sleeve top. But overall, I think this is really well done. I think it's a solid piece, and I really do love this as a full matching set. And last but not least, we have the Ozone Tank. This is more of a tight-fitted tank. I don't typically wear tight-fitted, I like loose, but I figure add it in so that I have the full range here for you. These are coming in the darker colors, so we're looking at lavender, gingerbread, carbon, and black. So as you guys can see, these shorts, the sports bra, and the leggings are coming in the full color palette range, whereas certain pieces like the long sleeve crop and the tank are coming in limited colors. You can see where it hugs in and accentuates the curves a bit, and they did make it clear that this line is supposed to be curve enhancing, hence the contouring. You can see a lot of that heavy rib going on right down the sides of your waist. Even though when it comes to tank tops and even shorts, I always prefer loose fit, I actually am cool with the way that this is sitting because of the curved hem. It kind of stays put around the glutes here. You could wear it at the gym and it still looks really flattering. I like how it comes down right in the center here. This is in my true size small. If you're in between, I would suggest sizing down. I would stick to your true size, but if you're in between, size down because I feel like if you size up, you might get a little more wrinkle going on right on the midsection. This is meant to be more of a tight form body fit look. All right, so that concludes today's Alpha Lee Ozone Haul review. Let me know down below, what are your thoughts? I gotta say, certain pieces like the long sleeve crop top, a definite win. An upgrade from the other long sleeve tops that I've tried from them. 
The other pieces, I think they're gonna be a little hit or miss for some. I know a lot of you who love Alpha Elite for the Amplify, this is definitely different, but I also have people who want something more than the Amplify, so that it's a little more durable at the gym. Something that can hold up and really endure those intense workouts, so I feel like they really nailed it with that. Because you can definitely feel it. Just wearing it, you can feel the durability factor, that this is a solid set that you could definitely get down and dirty with at the gym. Overall, definitely not bad, and I'm really happy to see them entering into more of the sustainable realm. Thank you all so much for watching. Again, do not forget to enter in on the giveaway, and don't forget to use my code GATA at checkout to save yourself 10% off your entire order. If you do use my code, let me know so I can personally thank you. I love you guys so much, and I will catch you in my next video.